Okay, I think I'm gonna be able to be heard now because the laundry is not as loud, but it's still going. That could be a problem. Hi everyone, and welcome to today's video. Um, I don't really have anything planned for it. I was just kind of doing an update. Very echoey in this room, but at least you can see my eyes in this one for once because usually there's a terrible glare. Not today though, so. We are currently in my old room, which, let's be honest, it looks a lot nicer in here with the walls painted than it did whenever I lived in here. Mostly because my parents didn't want to paint it when I lived in here, <laughs> but I like the wall color better. It's become an exercise room. Yay! <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. I've been thinking I need to try and be myself more in the videos because I feel like I'm, I I think it's because I don't really have a lot of space to myself um, in the home that I live in right now. So once I'm able to move out, that will change. Um, but as of right now, it's kind of hard to actually do videos and stuff because of my living situation. I'm gonna fix that when I can. Um, because I have the house alone to me right now, my family is like at their jobs and my sister is out hanging with friends, I'm able to kind of express myself better, at least I feel. And I'm getting a little bit more comfortable in front of the camera, so yay. Um, I, I feel like I've been, I've been feeling a bit, um, how do I say? I haven't really been in the mood to do any videos either just because I've been trying to figure out myself. Um, I got kicked out quite a while ago from my um, parents' home. I would say it was April of this year, so that was eight months ago? Yeah. So about eight months ago, I was kicked out and... I quit from a job that I really didn't like, did not like working there, um, and I, like my whole world kind of started crashing down because that was my newer job after my, I used to work at Target, so my Target job, it, the store ended up closing down. After that I got the new job, Tractor Supply, I hated working there. Not saying Tractor Supply is a terrible place to work, I don't know, people might like it. I didn't enjoy it that much. And yeah, so got kicked out, uh, quit my job, moved in with my boyfriend, and I've been really depressed for quite a while. And I'm, I've been feeling I'm just starting to kind of pick the pieces up together, or like gather everything up and start deciding, yeah, I want to make something out of myself. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I... I want to be, <laughs> I want to be successful. I mean, I'm sure everyone does. Most of us, at least. I've, <laughs> and I'm discovering more things about myself too, which is a crazy ride in itself. Um, I don't know if I've said before, but there's still personal things about myself that I'm just gonna keep for now. And maybe later on in the future, I'll share them just right now. It would be, it's not something I'm prepared to deal with. So I'm going to stay in the closet on those. Thank you. Yeah, so it's the holiday week. It's after um, the 25th of December or Christmas as some would celebrate it. My family does. I kind of do and don't. I'm, this upcoming year, I'm gonna work on practicing more pagan holidays and Probably in the future, I'm just gonna make, like, just clash everything. I'm eclectic, I just throw all that shit together and hope for the best. Um, so, I've been staying at my parents for the week. We're kind of on okay terms, so everything's been chill. Um, I've had the pleasure of <laughs> going on trips with my sister since she's learning how to drive and she was driving us around the back roads. That was a lot of fun. It's nice to see her growing in ways that 
you never, I guess you never really think your younger siblings or even cousins and stuff like that. It's fun to see them grow and change. Um, we had Christmas, um, kind of lounged about most of the day, but it was all right. I've been hanging out a lot with my brother, which is great. I enjoy every minute of hanging out with him. We're like, if we weren't siblings, we'd probably be really good friends. I went out with my friend uh, for the winter solstice, actually. I feel like that was actually one of the first times I've ever actually done something for the solstice. Because usually I just stay at home and um, do little things for myself. I haven't really practiced with them, but if I know that it is the day of like one of the espats or sabbats or whatever, I'll try and like, you know, at least say like, oh, happy solstice, you know, just kind of do something online for it. Um, this was the first year that I've actually went out and partied. <laughs> And we went to something called Emo Night, so yes. We went to Emo Night and it was a lot of fun. Just first time I've ever really went out drinking with friends and I cannot tell you, <laughs> it was something I really needed. So that was great. And then this upcoming weekend, um, going to my grandparents and we're gonna like kind of have our Christmas get together for there, so. Looking forward to that, and then I'll be back home and getting back to job searching and hopefully, you know, obtaining a job and saving up money and preparing for whatever I want to do with my future. And that's kind of the majority of what's been going on right now. I feel fairly optimistic for things. Um, there's a lot of things I've been thinking about college being one of them I kind of for me with college it's never been like trying to force myself to go I always want to kind of leave it open for myself if I want to then I will I think I really do but some moments I feel like I don't so I've been kind of thinking over like I have a little notebook at home with a bunch of like college the college ideas and colleges I might want to go to just to kind of get myself I guess optimistic for it, um, motivated. I, it's nice to keep something for myself to be like, yep, if I want to, I can try and do that. But of course, without money, that's a lot more intimidating to do, I suppose, especially when no one in your family, in your immediate family, has any college um, experience. So you would be doing it all on your own. <laughs> So I am usually, I say usually, but I am. I'm very introverted. I like to keep to myself. Scorpio, very secretive. Um, I'm introverted, so it's hard to post myself online. Especially, especially posting videos and not necessarily having any, um, not saying I expect immediate response, but it just being like, does anyone actually give a shit? Like, would I give a shit if I watched my videos? But then sometimes I watch a couple of them back and I'll be like, yeah, those are cool. I don't know, I guess we're all the ultimate judge of ourselves, so that's probably what's playing into it. Um, I don't know, I'm just trash. And I'm sitting in my old room, and it's an unused exercise room. It's getting dark in here now, too. And I'm upset. Hold on, I'm gonna turn on the light. Okay, now you can see my face. Delightful, isn't it? You can also see, I don't know, everything better. I've got my David Bowie shirt on. I'm not gonna get up, but I have it on. Uh, excuse you. Fuck off. Ugh. 
Anyways. Yeah. Stay chill and expect another video, because I don't think I'm going anywhere. At least I hope not. Bye.